The U.S. Navy flew a patrol aircraft through the Taiwan Strait Wednesday. The move coming one day after the U.S. and China discussed easing tensions in the Indo-Pacific. Though the strait is in international waters, China considers it its sovereign territory. Beijing sees passage of any foreign aircraft or ships a challenge to its territorial claims. China sent fighters to monitor and warn the surveillance plane and later played off the flight as public hype. The Eastern Theater Command of the People's Liberation Army said troops in theater are always on high alert and will resolutely defend national sovereignty and security as well as regional peace and stability. Taiwan's defense ministry said China often engages in a show of force by sending fighter jets and warships to the region. The U.S. did issue a statement saying, By operating within the Taiwan Strait in accordance with international law, the United States upholds the navigational rights and freedoms of all nations. The flyover came a day after the first meeting in a year and a half between U.S. Secretary of Defense Lloyd Austin and Chinese Minister Dong Jun, and shortly before Secretary of State Antony Blinken's visit to China. The Pentagon press secretary says freedom of navigation was a topic of discussion between Austin and the Chinese minister. There was a discussion uh, about the fact that the United States will continue to fly, sail and operate safely and responsibly wherever international law allows. China froze talks with the U.S. in November of 2022 in protest to Nancy Pelosi's visit to Taiwan. Beijing responded with military exercises, firing missiles which splashed down in surrounding waters.